Recently, we've had a lot of updates about the Yellowstone supervolcano. Researchers have come forward and said they're keeping a close eye on the caldera, as it's been giving off warning signs. The volcano is constantly being monitored by the United States Geological Survey, and every so often they give us updates about what's going on. Researchers in 2014 were surprised when they discovered that lots of gas was being released from Yellowstone, possibly thousands more than they expected. One of the lead scientists said the following, We had a moment when we realised that that's a lot of crustal helium coming out of Yellowstone, far more than we predicted. Study co-author Bill Evans went on to say the following, Two million years might seem like a really, really long time to people, but in the geological timescale the volcanism is a recent phenomenon. One of the reasons the helium was released was because a hotspot of collected magma made its way to the Earth's surface. Dr Evans said think of it this way, you have these old crustal rocks just sitting around for hundreds of millions, perhaps billions of years. They have this boring little existence, and then suddenly somebody puts the heat on under them, and they start giving up on all their long-held secrets. It's things like this that are making people worry about what's going on at Yellowstone. Just recently, the United States Geological Survey has reported that 81 earthquakes have recently hit Yellowstone. Most of these have been small, but researchers say the size of them is irrelevant, and it could mean that something bigger is about to happen. Portland State University geology professor Dr. Scott Burns said the following, A large amount of small tremors have been detected around the national park. Other researchers have said that magma and gases underneath the park are starting to rise. Not only this, but the United States Geological Survey has said the famous steamboat has erupted seven times in June. This means that it's broke the record for the shortest interval between eruptions. Data has shown that in the past 12 months over 200 earthquakes have hit Yellowstone, and this suggests that a huge tectonic plate shift has taken place underneath the surface of the Earth. As of right now, the researchers are telling everyone not to worry as they're keeping an eye on the data. So my question to you guys is what do you think is going on? With all this increased activity, do you think that something is about to happen? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.